how's the university is it good the most worst thing is the food i think government should do something for what what is the problem with the food really aloo is tasty uh, so you are well aware of the ongoing hijab issue सर अगर आप सत्ता में आएंगे तो आपका क्या नजरिया होगा मेरी व्यू है कि जो महिला पहनना चाहती है वो उसके ऊपर है सॉरी आप प्लान वॉज टू मीट यू देर एटेंटली और वाइस चांसलर सेट नो सो टेल मी क्या क्या पढ़ रही है आप लोग एवरीबॉडी लॉ एंड हाउ द यूनिवर्सिटी इज इट गुड इफ इट वॉज नॉट गुड वुड यू टेल मी यूनिवर्सिटी स्ट्रक्चर How many lady students are there? I guess eighteen thousand. Women students. Eighteen thousand. Eighteen thousand. Yes. Wow, it's a lot. Yes. So we are all are here from different hostels. Okay. Sir, I have a question. Uh, yeah. Like, uh, no. Hectares. Hectares. Not 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 hectares. To come into politics. So, what's your take on this? India is a strange country because there's not enough representation of women in business. There's not enough representation of women in politics, but there's more than enough representation of women in Manrega, for example. If you see the laborers, there women have full representation. So, point I'm trying to make is that given the jobs, the sort of lower end jobs, but when it comes to the higher end jobs, when it comes to you know big positions in corporate india or big positions in bureaucracy when it comes to these positions they are not given that much space in the political system if you want to give women space we had done a huge thing by making lot of uh, local body politicians women you know pradhans and wards and stuff but somehow one finds that even though they become pradhans then they don't move up the chain and become mlas and you know so i think emphasizing political parties and also in general telling public that women should participate is is important so you are well aware of the ongoing hijab issue so agar aap satta mein aayenge agar aap prime minister banenge to aapka kya nazariya hoga ki ek aurat abaya aur hijab pehen kar free nahi feel karti hai kya abaya aur hijab utar kar dekhiye mera meri view hai meri view hai ki jo mahila pehanna chahti hai wo uske upar hai agar wo abaya pehanna chahti hai kuch aur pehanna chahti hai wo uska business hai uska kaam hai उसको अलाउ करना चाहिए मेरी मेरी तो ये राय है वॉट यू वेयर इज योर रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी एंड योर डिसीजन आई डोंट थिंक एनी बडी एल्स शुड बी डिसाइडिंग like how a lot of people who are already native to assam they still have not their uh, names registered in the nrc and uh, they lack their aadhar cards and which is an important part of like getting an admission into many uh, educational institutions like aadhar is mandatory so it's like uh, as a third person even my uh, i have this one friend she actually couldn't like she lost a lot of opportunities because of the manipulation of the aadhar card and she didn't have it because even though she was native even though her parents had the names registered she wasn't registered in nrc i think what what uh, the bjp is doing with all this nrc and all is the same thing which is weaponizing laws and to purposely incite people and to purposely discriminate against people i'm against that Thank you, sir. We came here to meet uh, Rahul Gandhi, sir. And the moment he came here, it was all a fan girl movement for all of us. We talked about the, the less representation of women in politics, and he answered over to all of us really patiently. उनके लिए मैंने कुछ लिखा था. 
एक लाइन कि शहरे चमन को अपने बाहरों पे नाच था वो आए और सारे चमन पे छा गए और उन्होंने मुझे अपना ऑटोग्राफ भी दिया हमारा जोड़ो यात्रा दैट इज अ वेरी वंडरफुल इनिशिएटिव बीइंग टेकन बाय एनी पॉलिटिकल लीडर ऑफ कोर्स व्हाट कैन बी मोर बेनिफिशियल और व्हाट कैन बी मोर थॉटफुल देन ब्रिंगिंग द होल इंडिया टुगेदर तो भारत जोड़ो यात्रा इज ऑफकोर्स द बेस्ट वे टू डू दैट थिंग